Hello, I'm Dr. Payal Bhandari, an integrative family physician practicing in San Francisco, California since 2005. Urinary tract infections is an extremely common problem among women, causing more doctor's visits per year than everything but the common cold. In my last video, I explained how you can contract a urinary tract infection. Now I'll elaborate on what risk factors increase the development of a UTI. When the natural acidity level, or pH, of the bladder increases, unhealthy bacteria that are normally in your bladder have the opportunity to overgrow. Under various circumstances, this bacterial overgrowth can lead to a bladder infection. The falling foods directly increase your bladder's acidity level and allow unhealthy bacteria to overgrow. Number one is sugar. Sugar is in everything. You can find sugar in processed and prepackaged foods like dried cereal, granola, or protein bars, chips, crackers, condiments like ketchup, soy sauce, mayonnaise, salad dressings. Sugar is in fruit snacks, dried fruit, ready-to-eat dry and frozen meals, baked goods, sweets, breads, candy, sweet drinks. Sugar is maple syrup, agave, honey, high fructose corn syrup, and cane sugar. It's in everything. Number two is artificial sweeteners that are labeled as a sugar-free alternative. Some examples include asperidamine, saccharin, and sucralose. Artificial sweeteners are not recognized by our microbiome, and they cause major havoc to our immune system. Number three is alcohol. Alcohol is basically sugar water. Alcohol is digest, metabolized as formaldehyde in the liver and cause major havoc to your immune system. Number four is red meat and all dairy products because they increase the acidity level of the blood and bladder. Number five is caffeine, such as in black tea, green tea, coffee, chocolate, hot chocolate. Caffeine decreases the blood flow to the bladder, which leads the immune system to have a hard time shutting down a bladder infection. Number six is if you have a heavy meal at night, which contains animal proteins like eggs, dairy products, poultry, fish, or red meat, because these foods increase your bladder's acidity level. Number seven is corn and corn-fed animals and fish. Corn is extensively hybridized today in the United States, so our body really has a hard time digesting it. Corn really hurts the natural balance of our microbiome and increases the acidity level in our blood and bladder. Number eight is if you have frequent intakes of potatoes, sweet potatoes, wheat, and white rice, because all these foods break down to sugar and help feed the unhealthy bacteria. Due to the influences of the above foods hurting the immune system and the microbiome, it is easier for unhealthy bacteria to overgrow in the bladder. Under certain circumstances, people are more prone to developing a bladder infection. These activities include the following. Having sex. After sexual intercourse, it's easy for bacteria to be introduced from outside of the body and travel into the urinary tract. Having a new sexual partner also increases your risk of being exposed to new bugs. Number two is holding your bladder for long periods of time can lead to difficulty clearing unhealthy bacteria from the bladder in a timely manner. Number three is after prolonged exercise, especially while wearing spandex or restrictive clothing. Bacteria often get trapped when we wear tight clothes. The moist environment makes it easier for bacteria to overgrow. In my next video, I'll explain how you can avoid urinary tract infections.